Hello and welcome back to Edward 12 on Electro Linux. Today I'm going to be showing you how to install Spotify on Linux and this will work with any Debian based, whether it's Ubuntu, Mint, Zorin, Debian itself, any derivative, basically Crunchbang, the Shebang. Um, it says add this line to your list of repositories by editing yet. Yeah, it's the app sources.list file. The easiest way to do that, first of all, you need to log in as root on a terminal, and then you need to do nano, and then we can copy and paste this in. I'll put the links in the, distro in the show notes. Uh, no, we don't. That's the um, wrong one. This one we'll copy in. Right. This is every repository. There's a lot more in Zorin than these in Ubuntu. So we just copy that in there. Do Control X and then Y for yes and Enter for for save. You see here this up arrow means it's Control. So say Control G gets help. MD does DOS format. MMC does Mac format. MA does append. MP pen, prepend and then MB backup file. So if you press enter, save it. And you'll need to add their um, public key. Because Synaptic likes to know everything's being verified. Just press enter. And then you do a sudo apt get update, which updates your repositories. If you put, put and and in there, it'll do this after it's finished the other one. So you don't have to wait for it to finish and do it straight away. Now if you do is click enter. It'll refresh the repositories, and then it'll find the repository that, and then it'll find the Spotify client, and then it'll ask you if you want to install it. It takes 78 meg, and it'll take 35.5 meg to download from the archives. So it'll download the Spotify client. There you go. 35.5 meg in seven seconds. Yours might be not as fast. And then it has to uh, install the libav codec, and then it'll install it. And then when you get back to being able to type on the command prompt, it's installed. This this obviously adds a dev file. I don't know why they can't just add it into Ubuntu software center because a lot of people do use Spotify, and it isn't Ubuntu based package but it is a preview so it's not an official release alright so then under the menu you should type in spot and there you have it and you've got Spotify you can log in with your Facebook or if you've got a Spotify account you can log in with that be sure to like, subscribe, comment and rate this video and I will look forward to seeing you in the next one.